During the Vicksburg campaign, the Union Army had to cross the Mississippi, but they couldn't cross north of Vicksburg because of the swampy terrain, so the only way to cross would be through south of Vicksburg. Building a pontoon bridge was out of the question, so the only way the Union Army would be able to cross the Mississippi would be with transport ships. The only problem was that the Confederates had about 172 cannons at Vicksburg aimed at the river, so the Union Navy painted the boats black and stuffed bales of cotton around the engines to muffle the sound, then at around midnight on April the 16th, they used ironclad gunboats to protect the transport ships as they ran through the Vicksburg batteries. As the Confederates open fire, Admiral Porter realizes that the Confederate cannons are situated where they cannot hit the near bank of the river, so he orders for the gunboats to hug port side, and all but one of the ships make it across, allowing for the Union Army to cross the Mississippi and later lay siege to Vicksburg.